Hi everybody from a beautiful day in the Commonwealth. Today I'm looking at Faction Housing Overhaul, The Castle. It's by Eleonora and I just wanted to show you the castle as it is at the moment without the mod installed. Um, I do have The Castle Restored in and out by Hoser and I love it. It fixes all the walls. It's brilliant. I had it in my last playthrough and it's a must-have for me. So when I looked at the mod description for... Eleonora's mod it said doesn't interfere with the castle at all maybe it doesn't if your castle's vanilla but it does um, if you've got this mod installed so I'll quickly show you this is where it's located um, or will be in a minute uh, and as you can see my floors are beautiful and clean and everything's all neat and tidy and fixed and scrumptious I'll install the mod and then I'll show you what happens Okay, so once the mod's installed, suddenly I have these lumps and bumps occurring on my pristine floors. Um, some of them are pretty bad as well. So, you know, like in my last playthrough, I actually decorated this whole place and put in a gym and vendors and everything. And as a consequence, when all this suddenly appeared, once I installed um, this faction housing overall mod, I, I disabled it pretty quickly. So, I don't know, just as a word of warning in case you have the same issue. Um, it, it, it's a thing. Oh, but these walls though, I love this in its restored condition. This playthrough, as you can see, I've simply not had time to do anything with it yet. Uh, Greek Rage won't stop <laughs> issuing new mods like every week. So um, here we are. Now to get the key for this, it's locked when you first get here. To get the key, you have to get it off of the body of the general in the tunnel, which I did that m many moons ago and as a consequence when I went down there to have a look um, he was just in his underpants and uh, no key so I just unlocked it using a console command. So this is a really nice little addition. I love this room. It's super pretty. It's one of those cases where it's more kind of what am I trying to say really? It's uh, form over substance you know? It's very pretty, um, or as we would say here in the UK, fur coat, no knickers, insofar as it is very pretty on the outside, but there's actually not a massive amount going on in here. Um, there's loads of storage. There's no clickies of any kind. So the shower doesn't work, for example, you can't use the bath, things like that. Um, turning the fireplaces on and off that, you know, there isn't one, <laughs> so, you know, it's kind of missing a little bit for my personal play style, but I do love her aesthetic, I have to say. And she's done a cracking job at getting this. It really feels like, you know, the general's quarters, doesn't it? Nice. And like I say, bags of storage. And if you're just in that mood where you just simply can't be asked to, to make some quarters of your own, this is beautifully done for you. I mean, look, even a little pot plant there. Holy moly, there's no way on earth I'd use that colander. <laughs> you get r rusty bits with your lettuce. Okay, so yeah, as you can see, beautifully done. And name storage all over the place. This I like a lot. Oh. And there's a radio. And a terminal for playing your holotapes. Nice, isn't it? Lovely bed too. Very cosy looking. And that's it. So this might be the world's shortest video, or well, certainly one of my shortest for sure. Um, there's not a great deal to see, but there is a lot of beautiful decorative features. All right, I'll leave you with that view called at the end of this wee video. Say thank you as always for watching, and I will see you soon for the next one. Take care and stay safe, everybody.